Hi, I'm Matt Meyer, and I'm going to teach you how to longboard. Okay, to start things off, first thing you need is a longboard. We have multiple different kinds of longboards, and the first one here is a cruiser. Now, a cruiser is smaller, obviously, and it's just um, perfect to like get to class and uh, not really made for going too fast or doing any, any tricks on it, um, just made for transportation. Then you have the um, longboard made for downhill um, racing. Some people do racing on these. You can do a lot of tricks um, known as dancing on these. As well. Before you start longboarding, you need to make sure that you have proper safety equipment. This is a helmet. You want to make sure you wear it every time. Um, there's also You can also wear knee pads, uh, elbow pads, those kind of things to help you make sure that you have a fun time and that you're safe while longboarding. In this video, you can see that um, I'm placing my non-dominant foot in the front and I'm going to push with my um, kicking leg or dominant foot and you're going to try to keep a balance um, weight between both feet. As you can see from this video, um, I'm carving back and forth. I'm going to put pressure on my toes to my heels. And this is going to keep me from um, going too fast and keep controlling my speed. Learning how to stop is a big key in longboarding. There's multiple ways, and the way that I'm doing here is placing my foot down, using that as, a, as friction on the pavement. Occasionally in longboarding, you will fall and learning how to fall properly is a big thing and um, learning how not to hurt yourself and uh, just remember that even the pros fall once in a while the big thing to remember is after you fall to walk away like a champ once you start longboarding more you're going to want to become more creative and uh, dancing is one way you can do that you can do anything so from what we today? walking today, um, along the board to dancing to um, going on your, head, on your head if you want to yourself, just trying to be as creative cool as possible and make it most fun and also, finally, um, just to how to have fun in longboarding. Thanks, I'm Matt, and this is how to longboard.